couple of hours. So winter storm warning in effect that runs up until 1 p.m. tomorrow around the Wausau area stretches until the mid to late afternoon further north and it's a blizzard warning up in Ashland and Iron County travel not recommended there tonight or tomorrow morning. Winter weather advisory around Forest, Langley, Shawano, Wapaka, Washera County where the snow totals should be quite a bit less. Uh, lower and we're looking at uh, snow amounts here pretty dramatic once again. It's crazy how many heavy snow events we've had in the past two months. But anyway, 9 to 14 inches generally all the way from the northwest part of the area here from Ashland and Hurley over to Manaqua south to uh, Phillips and Tomahawk, Medford, Nielsville, even getting into the western part of Marathon County, Athens and Stratford. You could have a foot or so and all the way down to La Crosse and Sparta. Now there could be a few zones in there that even get 16 or 18 inches. So don't be surprised if you see some of those huge totals tomorrow morning. About five to nine inches here, just east of that from Eagle River and Rhinelander down to about Wausau and Merrill and stretching all the way down to Adams County, two to five inches more common in the eastern portion of the area. Now the other component here is the strong winds. We'll have northwest winds sustained around 20, 25 miles an hour tonight and tomorrow morning but the gusts could be up around 35 to 38. So that could create some very low visibility, especially in open sections of the vicinity. So uh, travel could be very difficult with that poor visibility. The wind does try to tame down a little bit later tomorrow. Today's high in Wausau, 54 at midnight. We picked up almost six tenths of an inch of rain so far. There's the view in Stevens Point. Looks a little drizzly right now. And in Wausau from the Jefferson Street Indy Event Center camera, rain with a little bit of snowflakes uh, mixed in here and there as well, 35 degrees. Dropping a little bit below freezing in the northwest part of the area, low to mid 30s elsewhere. Here's future track, the strong low pressure system intensifying in northeast Wisconsin tonight, causing the precipitation, that solid snow band just sitting on top of us for about 12 hours, tapering to scattered snow showers gradually tomorrow, but still a very unpleasant April day. It'll be nicer on Tuesday. The sunshine sh uh, should come out and there'll be less wind as well. Tonight's low in the upper 20s, that wintry mix becoming heavy snow by late evening. Tomorrow, the snow tapering the scattered snow showers gradually. Still very difficult travel early in the morning in many spots. Northwest wind 15 to 30 and gusty. We're looking at uh, temperatures here for the hometown forecast. About 20, uh, 32 degrees in Boulder Junction, 34 for Anago and southward. Still some snow showers and wind, 37 in Plainfield. The extended forecast calling for dry weather Tuesday, but then some rain moving in Wednesday and Thursday in the 40s. Might even have some light precipitation Friday and Saturday. Back